Hello everyone, this is Vivek from PyTech and welcome to my new video. Do you have an SMS inbox like this, which has loads of messages and it is very difficult to manage and find the message that you're looking for? Well, worry no more. Let's solve this today. So without any further ado, let's get started. The first thing to do is head to the Play Store and download an app called SMS Organizer, which has been created by Microsoft for Android. Once installed, let's open the app. Click the Accept button on the Welcome screen, which will take you through a quick tour of the app. You can see that you will have a clean SMS inbox by decluttering your SMSs to focus on the messages important to you. Smart reminders for your bills, travels, and movies your bank account balances, and of course, the backup and restore functionality. Let's click Next. Grant basic permissions like access to contacts, USMS messages, phone calls, and optionally photos and media. Now enter your phone number and click the Verify button. You will notice soon my favorite feature of the app. When you receive an OTP from any provider, you get a shortcut to copy the OTP without opening the message itself. This can seriously be a lifesaver. So if you observe at the top, I received the OTP and a shortcut to quickly copy it if required. Now your messages are analyzed and sorted. Click on Get Started. Click on Yes to change the default SMS app to this one. It is once again informing me about my finance cards. You can see now that there are different tabs that are available. The personal tab shows messages sent by a person to me. You can click on the toggle to view unread messages. The transaction tab shows you SMSs about your OTPs and card swipes. Again, you can use the toggle to show unread messages. The promotion tab shows you the SMSs received with ads in them. There are a couple of other tabs here at the top which I'm going to talk about now. You can mark a message as read by swiping left on the message. You can move the message to a different folder by swiping right on the message. So for example, let me move this message to my archive. Keeping the move future messages checked will move all future SMSs from this sender directly to the archive. So let me unselect that. You can now see that the message has been moved to the archive. You can follow similar steps to move a message to the blocked folder. At the bottom, you can see the second tab which shows your bill reminders and account balances. You can protect this with your pen or fingerprint if required. The last tab on the bottom is start messages. This is similar to the WhatsApp functionality wherein you can start a particular message to find it later conveniently. To start a message, press and hold the message and click on the star at the top. Once done, you can find it in the star tab at the bottom. Let's try that again. So press and hold the message, click on star, and then you can find that on the, in the star uh, in the bottom option. You can also change the way this app looks and switch on the dark theme if that's what you prefer. This is all for today. I hope you found this video informative. If you liked what you saw, then please do click on like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also click on the bell icon to get notified about my future videos. Thank you for watching everybody and I really hope you have a great day.